it's really hot. Damn, I think this is the real Africa. As you can see, the African mob behind me. No, don't look at this, brother. Look at the mob behind me. This is Africa. Different countries, one Africa. Different colors, one people. Most of you are saying that whenever I travel within Africa, all I do is to be hugging girls, kissing girls all the time without bringing something productive. Today, I am here to share something productive. It's all about investing in Senegal. But I got my brother here. He's not even, uh, no, I mean, people are going to get angry if I say he's not an African or he's not Senegalese. But anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Of course, I'm an African uh, no, man. No, are you African? Of course, man. Of course. One hundred percent. Wow. One hundred percent. I love the fact that you are claiming the African, you know. We, so, like you say, man, we're we're many different shades and colors, colors but one people. One man. people, exactly. Yeah, we are family. One family. That's right. What's your name, brother? Mahdi. RJ Mahdi. Mahdi. When I wanted to come to Senegal, everybody was mentioning your name. And I was like, who is this guy? <laughs> that everybody is saying, meet him when you get to Senegal. But finally, it's good to see you in nice, here. Nice. But today, I want you to educate us. Mm -hmm. But first of all, how long have you been in Senegal? I've been here five years now. Five years in Senegal? That's right. You speak Wolof? Yeah, fluently. Fluently? You yeah. speak French? I can teach you a little bit, man. Maybe we can How, how to say, how are you? Nagandef. Nagandef? <laughs> uh, and you say Mangifi. Mangifi? Mangifi. Mangifi. Yeah. Man, you're not Senegalese, Old Maya bro. speaks Wolof now. <laughs> <laughs> you're more than nice. Senegalese now. That's right. You know what? A lot of African-American, a lot of the diaspora, all of them want to move back home. Mm -hmm. But if anyone want to move to Senegal, mm -hmm. do you think it's advisable for someone to move all the way from wherever he is and move to Senegal? Mm -hmm. Sure, of course. I mean, there's uh, plenty of, of examples of, of, of folks who've been able to do it. Um, I think that once you kind of eliminate the fear factor, once mm -hmm. you eliminate, you know, those um, stereotypes that you've been told, once you kind of just step out on faith, you find that, you know, maybe it's not, um, you know, 100% what you expect when you get there. Okay. Uh, but then you find so many reasons to fall in love, man, and it's, you know, it keeps us here. Are you already in love with Senegal? Man, I'm in love with Senegal. Senegal is my home now, man. But Senegal is not your first love. <laughs> 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 you, know, you know, it's a, it, it's one of those kind of places where you you will always have, um, you know, beautiful scenery. Exactly. <laughs> no beautiful scenery mm -hmm. with beautiful women in here. Ah, you know, they 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 they're here. You know, <laughs> our African sisters are beautiful everywhere. Exactly. You know? <laughs> exactly. Absolutely. But brother. Mm -hmm. A lot of people want to invest in Senegal. Mm -hmm. I think you've already started this investment program in here. Mm -hmm. That's right. What are the things that, if someone want to move to Senegal, what mm -hmm. are the things that he or she can invest this money into? Mm -hmm. Man, I mean, the, the, the possibilities are unlimited. You know, you know, like I know, there's always things here that need development, that, that yeah. need, you know, some type of, um, you know, push. Exactly. Right? So, you know, you have industries like the telecommunications and media industry. You know, we watch TV, you see things, you're like, man, this could be better. Exactly. Right? With some investment. Um, you know, when you visit, you know, a lot of the different, um, uh, even tourist attractions and places, you see sometimes, you know, man, this could use a little bit of, of, of extra push, right? Mm -hmm. Just to help it look better or perform better or uh, create more opportunities for people. Exactly. Uh, so, you know, we've been able to get people invested in everything from real estate to poultry, you know, from agriculture to restaurants and franchises. Uh, folks have been able to get well invested in things here that actually provide jobs for people every day. So it's not just like you're investing for your own, you know, capitalist, um, you know, uh, gains. You know, you're actually creating jobs where dozens of people in one operation, you know, are now able to feed their families, pay their rent, you know, invest in their own homes. So. It's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a positive effect. There's this question that I know a lot of people are, want to ask right now because you're talking about investing in poultry, investing in real estate, investing in whatever, whatever here in Senegal. It all comes to money. Yeah. Do I need yeah. a lot of money to invest in Senegal? I wouldn't say a lot, but you, you definitely got to have some cash. You know, okay. um, the, the thing about it is uh, investing here is, is, you know, for the most part, a cash business. Uh, so, you know, be prepared to, you know, have a lump sum to put into it. And obviously what you put in is what you get out. Yeah. So there are operations and opportunities you can invest in for minimum, you know, a few hundred dollars, a few thousand dollars. Okay. But maybe your returns are not going to be that impressive. Um, but we're having people invest you know, on a larger level, and mm. they're seeing their returns right away. 
So I'd say, you know, to invest here, you know, just to kind of throw a number out there, any, anywhere between ten and twenty thousand dollars is a good place to start, uh, and then you can actually invest in something that that will actually pay you back. Pay you okay. back. Yeah. So which means that investing in Senegal mm -hmm. is worth. It's worth it. It's worth it, man. I mean, I've lived here for five years. Uh, we're well invested in a lot of these things that I'm, that I'm sharing with you now, uh, from exporting and tourism and media and you know, it all, it all, it all has a, it all has a, a factor here. You know, it's worth it. I, I mean, now I understand why everyone is saying I have to meet you so that you can share some knowledge to me and my followers out there. But before I let you go, mm -hmm. my brother, mm -hmm. I wanted to ask you a question, eh? but mm -hmm. I still don't want to ask in here. Maybe <laughs> after the video, I'm going to ask. <laughs> Are you single? Am I single? Are you single? No, no, I'm not single. You're not no. single. I'm, I'm, I'm spoken for. You know? <laughs> I'm I'm spoken uh, for. Yeah, that's all. I've, I've been seeing, no, no, that's all. Since that's I came all. in here, I've been seeing you moving around the beautiful sister. Uh, so I just wanted oh, to know. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. That's no, that's a different story. That's maybe, a different maybe, story. You know. We we'll leave it for another day. <laughs> 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 anyway, anyway, let, let, uh, me, let, let me continue. This mm -hmm. you have this project you call Made in Africa project. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Can you tell us a little about that? Of course. So you know, Made in Africa project is uh, you know we're here to connect the members of the diaspora who want to connect with Africa to give them a means to do so. You know, to be a you know intermediary. Okay. You know, to introduce them to the uh, legitimate operations that they should deal with. You know, wow. to to introduce them to the reputable people and personalities that they should you know follow or listen to or, or or believe because there's a lot of information that's being shared and there's a lot of uh, opportunities that are being promised and you know obviously people are tired of not seeing those things pan out or seeing them pan out negatively so you know it's important to be the one to say you know this organization is one that you know you can trust you can work with um, this is a safe place to put your money you'll be able to get it back you know and you know being here for the amount of time that we've been here has shown us you know what 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 ways are and what ways aren't you know yeah. so it's important for us to to make sure that those that come behind us they got the same you know the same information we got exactly mm -hmm. describe describe senegal mm -hmm. in three words senegal man hospitality so hospitable yeah. okay very hospitable very very welcoming um i'm gonna say uh um What's the best way to describe the weather in one word? <laughs> and don't say hot. <laughs> no, it's, hot it's tropical. <laughs> okay, that's my second word. It's tropical. Now, beautiful weather, man. Never, it's never cold. It's never uncomfortable. It's wow. just, you know. Wow. Uh, and then the third word, I'm gonna say, um, uh, peaceful. Peaceful. Yeah. He's saying that I shouldn't use the wet hot, <laughs> but he's feeling hot. But he's gonna say months not hot. It's the <laughs> middle of the summertime, man. It's it's hot. <laughs> Today is definitely hot, it man. It's definitely mm, hot. I'm gonna man. say it's probably at least a good 98 degrees <laughs> right now. <laughs> I'm dying, bro. <laughs> you see, this back is gonna be wet in a minute. And I'm wearing black, man. You can see what I'm going through right now. Man. Anyway, uh -huh. thank you so much for yeah. talking to us, bro. Yeah. RJ is also a YouTuber, mm -hmm. so if you wanna know more about him, if you wanna know more about Senegal, if you don't want to know more about how to invest in Senegal, right. all you need to do is to go to his YouTube channel, go subscribe, mm -hmm. and go support. RJ Africa. Mahdi, Africa is for Africans. Man. Africa for Africans. That's right. Nice talking to you, bro. Thanks, man. Thanks Appreciate for having me. It. Welcome to Senegal. Uh <laughs> Welcome to Hot Senegal. Hot Senegal. <laughs>